So my heart is breaking right now and going through the rite of passage of many parents. My, uh, <clears throat> my oldest daughter is packing up to go to college. So <sighs> I'm trying not to cry. It's a happy thing, you know, but, and I didn't think I would cry, um, but I guess I'll just look forward to going to visit her in a few weeks once she gets settled in. Whew. This is hard. Open the freezer and see. Are you vlogging right now? I am. <laughs> Bye, my girl. Eating in the box. You stay in there, gremlin. So I'm going to make a little snack. It's really busy, so I want something quick. So I'm going to make some bocadito. Just one little package of uh, doubled ham. And one container, let's see, eight ounce container of Philadelphia whipped. Mix it in Tupperware and put it on a sandwich. too hard to spread this with one hand. <sighs> There's your poop shot. Taking Chewy for a walk, giving him some privacy at the moment. It's really cold. We're supposed to get some ice for the weekend, but uh, you know, basically. Okay, you done, bye? Okay, let's go. Um, so I've got husband and younger daughter home. He has the week off, and she's got winter break. So, it's crazy at work, so it doesn't leave much time for vlogging. It's been a struggle the last few days trying to get some footage on anything. Not that my contact's ever riveting or anything, but you know, just something. Uh, yeah, that's been the challenge lately. Just trying to get everything done, and it's uh, usually I'm used to being home, you know, by myself for a good portion of the day in chunks, and being able to have things the way I want them, and get organized, and watch YouTube, and can't really do any of that. Got the TV going all the time, and have questions being thrown at me so <laughs> I'll have to catch up on stuff once everything gets back to the normal routine of things but anyway I'm gonna check in and as always tell you guys I love you catch you in a bit why did you rip up this paper hmm this is my paper Really? So another night playing with the new toy. I'm testing. I'm in test phase. So hubby went and got wings. We got bone in with the buffalo, right? And then we got bone less with the garlic parmesan. But I put them in here together and um, just cooking them at the default time so that I can get an idea of how much time is really needed, whether it be bone in or bone less, and work from there. And I think uh, we're gonna go ahead and do some crinkle cut fries tonight that he picked up. 
and see how those compare to the shoestring checker style we had yesterday. So let's see how it goes, guys. I'm excited. Okay, so here's where I could tell you a little on the experiment. We went ahead and we cooked those boneless ones with the bone in, and what I noticed is even though I stopped it halfway and turned them over, the basket was a little too full because some of these, like this one, on one side are real crisp, but the other side's really not that crisp. So what I did is I pulled the boneless out, um, I put the bone in back in the basket and flipped them all over and um, spread them out evenly on the basket and now they're back in there for five minutes just to try to crunch up the other side. And I might throw these back in, the ones that are not really that cooked like this one, back in just for a couple minutes just so they're crispy all around. But uh, it looks like it worked and we we're going to do crinkle fries. Allie's trying to finish off this bag so I think we'll have that debate in a moment. The extra five minutes made all the difference. So for those of you new to it, you want to do them separate, give everybody plenty of breathing room. It means that you have to do smaller batches if you're cooking for a lot of people. Um, just do smaller batches because you'll have to go back and redo them anyway if you try to put too many in there at once. I don't know if you could hear Chewy crying. <laughs> You don't want no part of this buffalo wing. All right, bye. All right, folks. You can see that Allie won the debate. We're having the checkers fries because it makes more sense to finish off that bag that's already open than it is to open a new bag. And here are the bone-in buffalo and the boneless zesty garlic parmesan. So before it gets cold, Gonna feed my family. Wish you all a very good night. See you tomorrow.